Hey, what's going on guys? Brimbo here today. This will be episode 2 of the Search and Destroy Nade Spot. So, I hope you guys enjoy this. I got a lot of good feedback from the last one. So, I decided to go ahead and do probably about 3 of these a week. Now, this is where the grenade's going to be landing. This is the radius. And shout out to King Jacob for helping me out this video. Go ahead and follow him on Twitter. I'll go ahead and leave his handle in the description. Now, we're going to go ahead and go on these stairs over here to the blue pot. You're going to go ahead and behind. You're going to go behind that. And you want to go ahead and put your right cross here on a tip, right on the tip of that flag. As you guys can see, I'm just going to jump around so you guys can see where I am. Now go back into the pot so you can't run anymore and put your right cross here right on the tip of that flag and cook the grenade for one second or for one pulse on the grenade and just go ahead and throw that thing and lob it right at them. They go right on the tip of the flag, the right cross here, and a ladder right on top of that V-bomb. Good job. Get ready for the next battle. Alright, so the next thing we have right here is on the A-bomb, as you guys can see, that's the radius. And this blimp just sits up there all day, it doesn't really do much, it just sits up there to look pretty. Yeah, but that's what you guys thought. So we're going to go in the corner right here, this gate. It's in the attacking spot, I'll show you guys. We're right at the corner of the gate, you want to go ahead and lay prone so you can't move anymore. And you want to put your right cross here, right in the end of the wing, or that satellite of the blimp. And you want to go ahead and cook a grenade for one second or one pulse. And by the pulse, I mean if you guys don't know yet, if you guys watch the grenade, it pulses to tell you when it's going to explode. So there you go. So go ahead and put, put your right cross here right on the tip of that wing. Get and go ahead and mob battle. it and land right in that radius of where I showed you guys earlier. So we got another grenade here that we're going to be hitting on the top of the A-bomb. I'm going to show you guys the radius where the grenade will be landing 100%, no doubt. That's going to be the radius. Now we're going to go into the side of the defending spawn. And I honestly think people at Sledgehammer are doing east rays for these grenades because we're lining things up in the end of blimps. We're doing so much whack stuff. We're going to be lining up with a cloud in the end of a light. You go ahead and see in a second. So you want to get your bottom cross here and you want to put on a tip. Yes, a tip again of the cloud and you want to put your left crossed here on the end of the light as you can see on my iron sights of the bow how the light dims out right there you want to go ahead and put your left cross here on the end of that light so I'm moving up where the light dims out you want to go ahead and cook your grenade for one and it'll land right on top of that A-bomb I know I hit it every single time I don't know how I found this out I'm just battle. too good here it goes right across the whole entire map right off the chair bang Boom, he's dead. So we got another A side grenade. Here's the radius of where it should be hitting. Well, it will be hitting actually. So we're gonna go back over here. I don't like people that rush a lot, it irritates me, so I had to stop that. I had a bright idea. So you wanna go behind this light over here and you wanna put your left aimer on the end of the wood and where the wall starts. So you can see the white paint of the wall and where the wood ends. I'm going to go ahead and put your left aimer right there where I just shot with my bow. I put paintball on as well, guys, so you guys can go ahead and see exactly where it is. So put your left aimer right there. Go ahead and cook a grenade for one, and I'll land right on top of the bastard. Good there job. we go. Get ready for the next Perfect battle. nade. Very easy to do and very fast. It's nothing they have to line up with that hard. It's a very simple grenade, and you can do it really easily to go ahead and get those people that are like to rush the A-bomb. I know, I know, I know what you're thinking. We got another grenade at the A bomb, but this is this is a great grenade. Just wait. So there you go. There's the radius of the grenade. We're gonna go actually to the B bomb now. I think this is a very good grenade for the simple fact that if you plant the bomb today, who's gonna think of going and checking the B bomb? They're not going to. So what we're gonna do is come to this third table right here, or the second table, and you want to put your top of the cross here, right where the glass is starting to come a little full. So put your top aimer there, and you slightly want to move your crosshairs to the right, and go ahead and cook your grenade for one, one pulse, or you can just count one second to throw it, and it'll land it right ready on top of the Now, this is probably my favorite grenade, because, like I said, they're going to be going to the B, uh, A bomb to go ahead and try to fuse that. Okay, now we have a pre-nade, as you can see my guys right there. A lot of people like to sit up there on top glass and like to pre-snipe and watch across down the A. So that irritates me as well, so I had to find a grenade of how to hit that and get rid of them. So I get my teammates down to A. So you want to go on this fire right here, you want to go to that big twig or log, and you want to go ahead and line it with that, and then line it with the middle of the chair. 
you can see I'm perfectly lined up and you want to put your bottom cross here on the little tiny dip of where the roof is and the siding of the palace so go ahead and put it there and you want to go ahead and cook this grenade as well for two pulses or for two seconds you go one Good two job. and you want to throw the, the grenade battle. and it'll land right on top of top glass Now, like I said, a lot of people like the pre-snipe, so a lot of people like the pre-snipe on the other side as well, so maybe they won't be pre-sniping anymore, or maybe it'll just be grenades back and forth. But as you can see, my guy's all the way down there. King Jcos, thank you for helping me out once again. We're going to go on the corner where this big pot is with the dead tree in it. We'll go ahead and run all the way in the corner. And you want to put, as you guys can see, that twig that's coming out of the tree right there. And we're like the skinny part of the tree. Well, the whole thing's skinny because it's dead. But you want to put your uh, top aimer right on the curve of that part of the tree. And you want to go ahead and just cook your grenade for one. And it'll land Good right, perfectly right on top of that pre snipe. Alright, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Go ahead and subscribe. Leave a like if you guys enjoyed these tips and tricks videos. If you enjoyed these nade spots videos, it really means a lot. And make sure you guys tell your friends. I'll talk to you guys later. Peace.